<laughs> Welcome to Spooktober. <laughs> Hello and welcome back to Darkler. Firstly, I'd like to roll well, Darkler Summer in Spooktober. Firstly, I'd like to apologise for the short, well, not really apologise, let's say, well, yes, apologise. Just say that there was a short episode. I literally just solved the bloody thing I've been trying to solve for ages. So, yeah, not sure how long that video is yet, but it's shorter than usual anyway. Anyway, let's get this submarine down. Do we just turn it until it's on? Okay. Fuck happened. There's nothing I can do with these. I think we need to go plug Catherine back in. Find out what the hell just happened. Oh no. The doors are sealed. Oh, however, this is now open. So let's move that to there. Oh. Need to move it a bit along. There we go. Okay, so the rab the submarine was a AI slash robot. Loading. Plan B. So we are now halfway through the game. There's nothing down there, right? No. I thought there wasn't. Unless I missed something. Hmm. So, what's plan B? Open this door when we can get to it, and hopefully we won't have to crouch for any longer. Yay, no more crouching. Hmm. <coughs> so this is a bomb? Looks like a bomb. Looks very much like a bomb. Okay, there we go. Let's plug her in. Huh? Wait, this isn't. Oh no! Wow got to the dime bag before we did, am I right? Well, we're yep. talking. That's rarely a good sign. Damn it. The dumb bat was our best shot. I was really banking on this to work. Come on, we can't quit now. There's got to be another way. How do you think you did it? How did the team get the Ark down the Abyss in the first place? If they didn't right. use the Dunbat, the only other way would be the Climber in Omicron. It's like an elevator which supposedly reaches all the way down into the Abyss. Okay, so we do that. We go to Omicron and take the elevator. Yeah, okay. Sure. We'll just head over to Omicron and hope there's a power suit that fits you. You know, so you don't end up in the Abyss. That does sound useful. All right, let's go then. Wait, what is this place? Seems to be a lot of information on the art here. 
There's a prototype and everything. Okay. Let's start it up. I want to see how it works. Maybe we can figure out how to get on the Ark. You didn't know okay. get us on? How difficult could it be? Time to get to work, people. Documents. I've decided to finalize the arc with scans we have. I'm sorry for all of you who wanted to go but didn't get a chance. Scan yourself before the project was put on hold. It's been two months since valid scan. I don't see how I'll ever be able to win back the support you all showed when we started the project. Sorry I never meant for anyone to take their lives. It was never my intention to fool anyone. I just wanted to save something. Um... Oh, this is all it. Okay. Apply interface module. Seal our capsule ask. Right, okay. Let's leave that up just in case we need to. A moment is about the interface. By the way, I know I just didn't well, finish that sentence. Alright, I'm in. Bit of a tight fit. Can you reach the on switch? Here we go. Should I be worried about radiation? I think we're beyond that. Interesting. You seem to be one with the diving suit you're wearing. Everything's meshed together. How's that gonna work with the suit we're picking up at Omicron? Um, I think they're bigger. You should be able to wear them both. Imogen? Who's that? It looks like the basis for your body is one of my old colleagues. A standard cortex chip for robots, including the data reader and the ocu torch, has just been forced through the skull. What? Structure gel has fused the whole construction together. Amazing stuff. No, 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 no. Hold on. Back up. I'm one of your old colleagues? Well, your body is. Imogen Reed. That's disgusting. <laughs> hey, don't say that. She was my... Well, Girlfriend. Anyway, the cortex chip is good news. That means we can transfer your mind to the Ark with a pilot seat. Kath, I'm half a dead person. Yes, it makes sense. Think about it. All those simplistic minds we've run into? Just reviving a dead person doesn't seem to work that well. A robot body seems to make people a bit unreliable. You are the best of both worlds. A sound mind and a sound body. At least we know how to get on the arm. Sort of. I understand the concept, but I don't know the specifics. I really wish we could figure out how the scan data is formulated and processed. Alright, what else is that to do? Swipe Omni tool. Okay, well it looks like everything else is to swipe the Omni tool. Start an arc simulation. I want to see how it works. Oh. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Sort the arc all the way over there. <clears throat> Recently, it was decided that the arc project would become FAFO's two last official commitment. The staff have been urged to carry on with their duties despite Earth's catastrophic condition. I think the ARC project is the most logical step towards saving mankind and that we should spend as much time and resources as we need to complete it. Yeah. To embark every passenger needs to be flushed with electric mechanism, electricity, good nausea, lasting up to three, I think physical. How severe? Agree-ish. The arc is built for a mid-ranger probe, might mean getting shot into space with Megas space gun. Technically it's 5,000 years living off the light from our sun and distant stars. I think the Earth should leave. Which the only way, so I agree. I think we're at risk of losing our humanity if we have we if we were to rid ourselves of disease and mortality. Not really. 
I think even an inferior group of artificial people would benefit our society. Wait, there are only 58 people left alive to be stored inside the Ark. A way to just for diversify and expand the population with speech. Ah, okay. <clears throat> mm, I agree, ish. I mean, people might want to have kids. So, strongly agree. I'm the less majority. Strong Everyone strongly agreed. But me. Wait, do I press this screw on that one? Oh. Oops. Alright. Is that it? It looks like that's it. Okay. Let's see if we can get this arc survey to work then. Uh, do we have to unplug? Oh no. I thought we might have to unplug, but we don't. No device connected. What device? What device do you need? Oh, right. There we go. Hook that up. <clears throat> memory correction. Please reduce memory footprint. Physics we need. Forest we don't need. Oh. Foliage. Okay. Oh, we're deselecting stuff. Okay, I don't know that. Let's do the cabin. Sun. Oh, the sun really fills it up. The moon fills it up too. So we need the sun and the moon. What can we get rid of? Okay, there we go. Oh, we've already got a scene. Right then. Well, that's good enough, ain't it? What do we need? Okay, if we put in all that, take out that. Wait, why is it saying next all the time? Why is it not saying next? Ah, because we need that. Let's take the sun out. We need light and water. Oh, so actually we can take all this out and just see what it says we need. So, we need Soma. Cisgen. Uh, Cisgen Advanced. Um, SysW Mod. Oh. SysW Mod Atmo. There we go. Sys interface, I go type light. Where is the light? So we need water. For that, we need physic and rigid and boy. Where's the light? No. Oh, there it is. <clears throat> and W mod heat. Oh, okay. Okay, so we do need that. Wait, type water? No. Is there multiple things for water? No. Right then. W mod heat. So, we can get rid of any of this? Why can't we get rid of this stuff? 
What are we meant to get rid of? Because we've only put stuff that we need. Oh, is there a list of what's required? And what's not? Let's have a look. Sumo is required. I'm probably just going to cut this out. Actually, I might not. I'm not sure. Ah. Yep. Try loading a dummy scan. Shouldn't be that difficult. I just want to make sure I understand how the scan data is formulated before we start messing around with the real arm. Run the simulation and then hit pause while the code is running. It will give me a cross section of the process. You need to pause while the dummy is loaded, otherwise I can't know if it's working or not. Uh, I was dumb enough. Yes, of course. So precise and <coughs> perfect. Nothing like admiring your own work. What? Oh, right. Are we done here? Can we go to Omicron and get my new suit now? Yeah, we should get going. Want to bring this arc as a backup? No, that wouldn't work. This is just a prototype. Good. I prefer to travel light. Let's go. Don't forget to take me with you. Take me with you. That is good. Okay. So this is a water filled by the look of it. Straight on. Oh, hello. Stormer, Brad, where are you? It got out of hand. I'm in sector RD4. Did you get everyone downstairs? Yeah. We're safe by now, but you need to get moving. They're gonna figure out where we are and come for us. Don't worry about it. The 
Stairs are blocked, and I killed the elevator. Pull the connector chip from the lock. Fine. That means you're stuck as well. Only way to keep you guys safe. Take the shuttle, go to Omicron. God damn it, Juan. You just had to be the hero, you bastard. Good luck, sir. Tell Alice I love her. Damn. Poor Juan. He's not had a good life since this arc thing. Sure, the art makes it. Every launch is a crapshoot, you know that. I just wish these numbers look better. What do you care? It's just a pack of data, right? Yeah, just a pack of data. Hmm. Okay, <clears throat> nothing in here. Let's move on. Nothing in there. Nope. Uh. Ooh, hello. Let's heal up. Something's around. Let's close up the door for now. Hopefully you can't get in here. Don't be able to get in here. Oh shit, you can't get in here. Great. Bl fan blooded hashtag. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. That's why we need a lot of. It's fine, it shouldn't know where we are. I hear you, Brandon. What do you oh, it does know where we are. Great. Perfect. Just wonderful. Wunderbar. Right, let's close that again. I hear you, Brandon. What do you got? Akers and his critters are ferocious. They pick up on every move. There's no way past them. Then we'll fight them. We've got to get to the shuttle. And end up like shaking atoms? No way. Listen, I'll create a distraction and pull them to me. Get the gang to the shuttle station. Wait, Brandon, what are you doing? Don't worry, Alice. We'll be back as soon as you guys are safe. Just load up the shuttle. We'll be ready to go. Are you sure about this? I don't plan to die today, sir. See you at the shuttle. Hey, Brandon. Over a door lock. Mm -hmm. System malfunction blocks. Active remaining resources serial. Corrupt, corrupt, corrupt. Machine hangar. Huge structure gel leak. It's caused the world to seize control over the dumb butt. Bugger. No fin good there. Check this survive the arc project. Stop people from killing themselves. Send off. And the team keep people safe. Enjoy the rest of and I get them. Right, let's get out of here. Okay. 
That looks like the thing from Half-Life 2. When they make it so that it switches to and from. Okay, this should break. Nope. is here. Dead bodies. On the worst case I've seen, it's more likely that his own damn fault he blinded himself and clogged up his inside structure jail. Uh, so he's killed himself on purpose to make me think of hearts beside your story about what happened at Lambda. Could it really be that Wilder somehow able to change and we built the dead? Heart appears to be in good shape. And bruises and mild hypothermia caused by a long walk. It's difficult to corroborate her story and she's the only one to return. As usual, trying is quiet and does her best to avoid contact. She doesn't want to be here, but Streamer demands another evaluation. Strain isn't what is on her, but she'd rather not speak if it can be avoided. She sometimes she has a hard time dealing with people in general, including doctors Catherine Chan as well. Oh, shit, you're there. I'm just gonna shut the door on you. Um so we can character the perfect victim to be Demi in there. She's a scared mouse, I don't want to upset, so we should sit quiet and pass the time. Conrad is dead, he brought his brain to pulp. Yep, fine. Don't really care. Let's move on. Oh, he's right there. So we need to move on quickly. Right. Let's try and get this to break the window. Okay, that's not going to break the window. Let's see what we can get in storage to break it. Oh, shit. Let's also heal up just in case we die. Because I don't want to die. Oh, no, we can't. Shit. Shit. Don't find me. Go on, get out. Get out. Okay, we're in the clear. Get out. I don't like you. Just leave, okay? I told you I never want to speak to you again. Because you're rude to me.
Get out of here. Just leave. Walk out the door. Oh shit, no you're not. You're gonna be right there, aren't you, you bastard? Oh, great. Goody. Yay. Yay, that's what friends are for. There we go, right, done. Go, go, go. Okay, good. Alright. Wait, is that... Yep, that's Brandon Wan. Crap. I'm sorry about before, Brandon. I'm sorry we couldn't let you rest in peace. Bloody hell. Get out the bloody door. Why won't you leave the door? And why can't you go through the window now? Ugh. Oh. Let's listen to his stuff. They got him. That's why. Wrong window. Door. Right, let's get out of here. Or at least let's try to get out of here. I don't know if we can. Is this where we need to go? Yes. Now what? No. The chip. Huh. Um. Huh. What are we meant to do? Come on, game. Oh, actually, this is a good point to leave there, ain't it? We've got the chip, you just need to figure out what to do with it. So until next time, I've been Darkler, this has been Simon Spooktober. Goodbye!